Hi there, this is Gino with Music Villa. Today on Gino Likes, we're going to play with the SE DM1 Dynamite Stick, which is a preamp for microphones. So uh, the first thing that's just really, really fun is the, the packaging on this. Um, it's got a fuse, like a real quarter stick of dynamite. What's going on here? Let's see, we just open this up, took a look at it. There's a little instruction manual. Kind of reminds me of candy. There's no candy in here. And then a little plastic uh, covering for the actual preamp. All right, now we got this little guy out of the box and we can see it's just a very simple device. There's no buttons or anything. It's just an input and an output. And the way you use this is we really recommend you don't plug it into your mixing board like this. That's really bad for the mounting and you don't wanna put stress on your, on your XLR connector on your mixing board. So the way you use this is just say this is your line. You're gonna go and put the dynamite stick right in line there. Okay, well, what this actually does, uh, we'll take a shot here so you can see on the mixing board, this gives you 28 decibels of gain, which sounds like a whole heck of a lot, and, and it is to be fair, but what it really does is it puts your microphone into it, or your signal I should say, into a kind of a different range of use. So you can use less gain on the gain pot, you might need to use your your pad switch depending on what you're doing. But in a nutshell, what's cool about the dynamite stick, in fact, I'm gonna do this so it's, it's right side up. What's cool about the dynamite stick is because of the way that they designed it, it's got a lower impedance than any other preamp out there, which lowers the noise. They're, they use a field effect transistor in their particular circuit, um, which is a little bit more sensitive and again, lowers the resistance just to give you lots of gain uh, with no noise. Okay, so we're gonna to wanna to listen to this. Um, I'll tell you a little secret about the whole sound industry is it's really easy for us to say when something's louder that it sounds better. And as popular as these broadcast microphones are, um, they have low gain on purpose. I'm holding our in-house MV3 broadcast microphone, which sounds amazing. Um, you can find it on our website. It's a, an incredibly good value against everything else that, else out there in the market. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're just gonna listen to our MV3 straight into our mixing board. All right, checking the MV3 microphone straight into the mixing board with no preamp. I will mention that our microphone has uh, four decibels more gain than the leading product out there. So although it, it looks like a total broadcast mic, it, it probably would work great without a preamp for you. But in case you need one, here's what it sounds like. Here we are with the SE Dynamite DM1 preamp engaged. 28 decibels a gain. Um, of course, does louder sound better? Maybe. It certainly will give you more signal to work with. Most folks are going to go ahead and they're going to talk on their podcast um, with the microphone this far away. This is what the preamps are really for. It kind of helps you to use that dynamic microphone when actually a condenser microphone might be the, the first choice for a lot of people. But these things look great and they sound wonderful. So with that extra 28 decibels, again, you can really hear it this far away from your face. You'll also notice that that big chest radio voice is gone when I'm this far away. All right, there you have it. The SE Electronics DM1 Dynamite Stick. Not only does it look cool, it gives you 28 decibels of gain for any signal you need to run quietly and accurately. There you have it.